Hello everybody and welcome back to Hunter Call the Wild and here we are in Hirschfeld and I'm gonna do another duck goose tutorial look at all them guys already alright here we are in my blind I got the layout blind let me show you what gear I'm carrying I've got the drilling number one I've got the Shokan assembly line the dose set oh hold on I got the Norden where you going geese come back here comes another group already we'll try using them both the Norden 20 gauge is nice because of its two three one two three two three. so no fours which means we'll just go to town and check our consec Can't believe you lived, thing. Oh, there you go. So three silver common. Three very easy common seven sixty six silver. And three common seven seventy one. Then you just hop back in. Uh, the pack there where the case goes is where your head lies. So you want that facing into the wind. Then they'll land towards you. I don't worry too much about it because I'm such a way ahead shooter. But kidding, of course. But it doesn't seem to matter too much. So we'll just settle in and wait for the next group. Oh, here comes some already. Some deer right there. All right, we got it. Where'd you go, little roe deer? Two six thirty six silver, five oh six cash. At the end of the episode, I will show you how your basic setup but I believe I got about 20 decoys out random ones so 2665 518 and a 1 585 479 so I got about 5 10 15 
20, 25 ish. Looked like 24 there. I might have missed one though. I think you need about 20 though. I'm really not targeting deer today, but I kept the solo with just in case we find something really nice. back there too. It's a pretty nice herd of ro or fallow deer. That's pretty cool anyways. All right. And I'll show you where I am on the map. I still have just kept my spot here. Spawn ends over here. And you come down along here, there's an outpost here and an outpost here. I got a tent set up right on the tree line between the fields. But this furthest field over here to the left from the spawn is a nice bowl. And I've just always had good luck here. I'm going to set another one. I've noticed that they hunt really good up in here, I think. But I haven't really even explored that far yet. So, in the future, I'm going to break some new ground soon. I'm working my way that way across here. And one cool thing about this spot is you get all kinds of stuff. Lots of foxes you can call in here. I've gotten a few buffalo. All kinds of fallow. Rows. Pigs will come through. So it's pretty fun for just some lazy hunting. That's for sure. And it's a good way to start your hunt. You can check your concept if you're going to reset the time. I do it mostly in the morning. Not even sure at night. I'm sure you get some through. You ladies don't got horns. There we come. There we go. Ooh, there's a four. A shooting bear. Other than forgetting to reload your gun, that was perfect. Let's see what we got. Nice, nice little grouping, Bav. Ooh, what do we got here? Brown hybrid. Already got one. Six twenty-four silver. Six seventy-two. There's a gold. Eight forty. That was the four. Six o two. Level up. And 
we got a three very easy 811 score 589 some more coming in it's only been seconds Give them a two, two, one, two, two, one, two, two. So all crap, we can just blast away. I'm not seeing any special coats, so yep, this is just money, bags flying in. Now with two shotguns, if we get a nice pack here, we'll go open up with the Nord and then I'll switch to the 16 gauge for a couple of longer range shots, if applicable. Are you kidding me? They got a little far away. You got to pause on that, picking up your second shotgun, I see. Won't draw immediately. So it's got a little bit of realism there. That That's kind of nice. Just a 1, 6, 11, 491. We got their silver. It was only a two, five forty-six cash, and another one for a five fifty-eight for a four sixty-seven. And you gotta hustle when you're out here, cause big groups, especially when I TP in. Fast travel to my tent. I mean, it's hard even to get in here when you reset the clock, cause there's and tons of them will be all over sometimes. All right, reload to Norden, Bav. First time using the camo one. She's pretty hot. Boom. Oh, here we go. Geese. A goose flat. Two, two, three, three, two. And a two. There's another group coming in. Two, two, four. Are you the one I want? Yep. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, nope, there he goes. Keep your eye on them when they drop far away. It is tough to find them sometimes, to say the least. Watch for tree, rock, anything when they drop out of the field because it's super hard. Four easy, quick kill, only 14. For a 660, 
nine. Not great. Another thing you can do is you can use your pistol to pop a few to get easy skill and then draw your shotgun. That is a technique I often use. Let's go for one more. That was depressing. We got our... There's a fox. If we can get him in close enough, I think a bird shot to the face. Keep your eyes open though, because those foxes will pop up. About as far away from the call as you could possibly imagine. The feeling's right in the tree line though. Come on in, little fox. There he is. Or easy. There she is. We'll let it come out in. Come on in. That group of three. Alright, got it, Bab. I don't know if that was the four, though. That went not great. But we got this four. Eight seventy, and I got a zero on my consec. What happened? And that was an eight seventy. What in the heck happened? That would have been a That would have been one, I think. Son of a gun. Common to All them fallows are up on their need zone. I will have to watch the video. I don't think I missed one, did I? Maybe I just winged one when they were close together. But thank you everybody for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, all that stuff. Let me know what you think, what you want to see in the videos. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one, everybody. Ah, so nice to be back and hunting. Look at how freaking beautiful it is. Later, everyone. Have a good one.